Uh-huh. Yeah. Today's lunches are going to be mini sliders. I also packed in apple juice for Madison with a granola bar, golden raisins, rainbow goldfish, and a couple of conversation hearts. Winter, of course, has the same ham and cheese slider with a banana, little wafers, a high sea juice because he doesn't like the apple strawberry, a mini rice crispy, goldfish, and he also has skittles. Okay, so I forgot to record what they ate, so it's a new day, I do apologize, but as you can see, the cookie cutter was pretty janky. This is a peanut butter and jelly sandwich that's supposed to be stars and hearts. It doesn't look like that. She's taking freeze-dried apples along with some goldfish, a Rice crispy, a granola bar, and her M&Ms. And Winter is having a turkey and cheese croissant with his Skittles. He has a Rice crispy, some goldfish, and he's also taking a high sea tropical punch and a banana. Okay, back at home from school, Madison ate her peanut butter and jelly. She ate part of the pickle. Um, okay, she didn't eat the Rice crispy. She ate the apples. Did you eat any of the goldfish? Okay, no worries. And then, but she had time to eat the M&Ms from the m and store. Okay, oh gosh, I'm gonna sit one hand. Um, Winter Junior, as you can see, I don't even have to pull anything up. Had no problems eating all his food, but he did not eat his little bit of skittles. All right. Okay, on this day, I tried a different bread. This is the potato bread and did a really good job cutting the, with the cookie cutters. She's having a ham and cheese sandwich and it's cut into the shape of a butterfly. She's also having some fresh strawberries, pretzel goldfish, and she will also be having some pickles, a granola bar, and a high seed orange juice. And I also gave her a little treat, which would be the conversation hearts. And for winter's lunch, we just have to get it out. And I am doing a voiceover for most of the mornings just because they're pretty loud in the morning. And <laughs> it's just easier for me to do the voiceover for that. All right, and then my phone case was in the way as well, but whatever. So. For winters, I also used the potato bread, and this was supposed to be dinosaurs. My husband did not think that it looked like it, but it did to me, and he's having turkey and cheese. He's also having a mini rice crispy with some goldfish that are underneath there. And he will also be taking the high sea juice with some Nilla wafers. It's one of his favorite cookies, and I put in some Ritz cheese bits crackers because he likes those and a couple of Skittles. He's pretty picky, so it's kind of a hit and miss with him for lunch. So far, he's been doing pretty good, though. So they take their water in these little stainless containers every day. And as you can see, he com completely ate every single thing that I packed for him. There is nothing left, so he enjoyed this lunch, which makes me feel good because... As I said, he's a picky eater, so he brings home everything and it's empty, it's pretty good. And then same for her. She ate her sandwich, which I figured she would. I knew she would eat the candy. She loves strawberries, so that was a go. I was on the fence with the pretzels. She said she wanted them, but overall, she did a really good job of eating her lunch. On Thursday's lunch, I decided to give the cookie cutters another go since it did so good with the butterfly, but it kind of messed up on the crown. She's taking some M&M cookies and some more dried apples, freeze-dried apples, and I inserted a little scratch-off card, and it just has, you know, a little note for the day, just I thought it was cute. Um, she has her conversation hearts. She told me she likes blueberries, so on this day, I packed some blueberries along with the strawberries for her to try and the rainbow goldfish. And then, of course, she has her water in her container to drink along with her lunch. And for 
his lunch. He has the same sandwiches. His came out a little bit better, but I still had a little trouble with them. Um, it's just ham and cheese. I, I think his is turkey and cheese. Actually, hers was ham and cheese. He has the goldfish, the rice crispy, and he also has some Skittles. And then for his fruit, I packed the banana. He has his favorite cookies. He also has the same little scratch card with a different saying. And he has some juice. And he also takes a water every day in his little stainless container as well. Okay, for after school, he ate everything. Oh, Winter, what did your note say? No, the other note, the one I put in your lunch. <laughs> okay, y'all, it's hard doing this with one hand. I do. It's a struggle. Oh, messy lunch. Okay, her school oftentimes gives them a snack. <laughs> she never eats it. I always tell her to give it to someone if she's not going to eat it because she rarely finishes her lunch. Okay. And so she told me she still has some sandwich left. Um, still peanut butter and jelly, part of a cookie. She did eat the dried apples, which I'd rather her eat the dried apples anyways. She didn't touch the candy, but she knows the rules. She didn't finish her lunch. She can't have that. She told me she likes blueberries, but I'm going to go with she doesn't because she ate all the strawberries and she didn't touch a blueberry. And then she didn't eat her goldfish. But she wanted an after school snack. So... I mean, minus these blueberries, she can pretty much snack on those goldfish while she waits for dinner. Okay, so this day was a complete rush. I literally just threw a sandwich together. This is turkey and cheese. He has a banana and other wafers and some juice. His rice crispy goldfish, like it was a rush. Some cookies for her, apple strawberry, juice, a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. It looks really crazy, but I mean, we were like late. I forgot to do this the night before. So it was a real struggle, but we'll come back and see what they ate. As you can see, the fact that it was very messy did not affect him eating his lunch. He did a really good job of finishing everything that was put into his container. And so that was a good way to end a Friday. And she did a really good job as well, minus a couple of strawberries. But I mean, this is pretty much the emptiest her lunch has been. So I just want to thank you guys so much for taking the time to watch our video. Please hit that like button and subscribe if you aren't already. And we'll see you next time.